folks. Uh, been removing these pins. Take a little punch of some sort. This is obviously a little uh, hex key driver. These guys here got uh, pins on them that have a little bit of stainless on the edge. You know, a little stainless on them. So, I gotta test them a little bit, but uh, I'm thinking I can dilute nitric those guys and uh, in that uh, won't uh, attack that stainless. Anyway, put these dudes in here like that and just do a little tap to get them out, right? A lot of the connectors, like the cast aluminum ones, you can just hit with the hammer and they, uh, you know, they come apart pretty good. And you can just disintegrate the thing pretty much with a hammer. And that way, uh, it's easy. It's easy, the aluminum ones are easy. I thought these would be easy too, but that plastic's some tough, tough stuff, man. It is tough. Got a couple of leftover pieces in here. Yeah, folks, I took one pin and put it in the speaker. A little bit of water, shot of nitric. You can see all the uh, gold floating in there. And that uh, stainless steel part is right there. All right, it ain't even eating up at all. So yeah, it's gonna be a good methodology. Uh, dilute nitric, you know, get the gold off those pins. And then, uh, yeah, all the stainless will be in there, untouched. And then we'll uh, process that gold after that. Yeah, you got those pins cleaned up pretty well. Got all the wires and whatnot off of them. Any of the junk. Yeah. 109.7. This bag weighs about a smidge over a gram. So... Basically, maybe 109. We can say 109. Yeah, 109. We'll say 109. Yeah, 109. There they are. These dudes right in there. Get the water on in here. About 100, like that. It's actually uh, it's all those pins in there. It's probably more like about 50 or 75. Anyway, yeah, we're gonna start with that. And we're gonna hit that with dilute nitric. Actually, we just hit it with nitric, <laughs> and it'll be diluted because we already have some water in there. So yeah, let's do that up. I want, actually I think I'm going to do this here guys, I'm going to grab this entire container. I'm going to put a little on in there. Like that, it should give us about enough to get it rolling yeah we got about 10 or 12 in there enough to get her cooking get that, we'll get it heated up and go from there it's only been a couple minutes about three minutes and it's already boiling yeah i've hit that with about seven or eight more squirts just like that get it ripping I see a little bit of gold floating around there now. Yeah, it's, it's getting down to it already. Yeah, it looks a little gnarly down there, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to uh, pour this material through a filter and we'll uh, see if we got down the bottom there if we wash them. Yeah, okay, let's get this last wrench here. Hopefully this will be enough. Books. I got 100 milliliters of water back in that dude 
and uh, it's basically rinsed pretty good right you can actually see through it so at this point I'm gonna dose it again with uh, some nitric there's about three I'm gonna grab the whole gizmo like that we got how much in there yeah we got about 50 so yeah let's hit it good and proper here Okay, yeah, we got about 30 in there, so good. That should really get it ripping. As we need it to be ripping. Get that last little bit. Why is she cooking now already? Woo! Okay, there we go. Let me get the lid on that thing. I'm gonna add a little bit of water. <clears throat> last time it looked like this copper got too thick, so I'm add 50 more. And then we'll, uh, yeah, we'll dose it a few times. Yeah, up to about 120 milliliters of nitric acid we've used burning up these pins so far so hopefully not too much more filtering this stuff right now Couple of pieces of plastic in there still, and some of those little black things there. I'm not going to pull them all out because they might have gold in them. I don't think Aqua Regia would do anything to them. I got out all the little stainless pieces. That was a pretty good little chore. Spray any, spray in each one. There might be a flake or two of gold in there, but not much. Yeah, there they are anyway, though, after toasting them. Okay, anyway, we got the gold off there. Stick that in a beaker, hit it with aqua regia. Hey folks, got myself a little bit of hydrochloric acid here. We're gonna add a little bit on in here. Got a whole bunch, move about 100, like that. Looks like I got a little bit of uh, nitric acid back there. I'll put a little squirt on in here. Three might be enough. I'm going to put six in though anyway. <laughs> I'm putting six in. There we have it. Alright. Get a little bit of uh, sulfuric. Put a little bit of sulfuric in there. Get the lead out. Get that lead out. A little bit of sulfuric acid here. Got to be a little bit careful with this stuff for certain. It's going to want to bubble and spit and spatter and all that. Add a little bit on in there anyway. In case it's got any lead in it. That, uh, that sulfuric will precipitate out any lead. So it'll be back to lead form. And then when we filter it, we'll get, uh, get that lead away from our gold. That's right. We'll bring that dude up to a boil a little bit. Make sure we got everything in solution. And we'll... Uh, Filter it, check it for any nitric, and drop that gold. It's starting to flip up a little bit, yeah. It's got a nice head on it. <laughs> yeah, you can see how yellow that material is getting there, that liquid, yeah, acid. Yeah, it's putting that gold in solution. And I give it kind of a little whirly dirly and knock it down a little bit. Possibly. Why not? There it goes. Yeah. She's a crashing now. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to add any water if I don't have to because uh, I don't want to uh, dilute her down. A nice strong solution that's loaded with gold. Yeah, you can see that filter all coming apart now. Yeah, it's just about had it. I think we got it there, folks. You can see some of that plastic junk floating around there, a little bit of that filter paper. 
It's about disintegrated. But yeah, pretty good. Let this cool just for a minute here. And uh, once yeah, so it cools a little bit, I'm gonna dump it through that filter into this other container. I have a filtered solution. And I'll put a little bit of uh, urea in there. Get any uh, nitric that's remaining out of there. That'll burn up the nitric. I'm gonna put a little sodium metabisulfate. Sodium metabisulfate will create sulfur dioxide gas, which will uh, push that gold out of solution back into, into metal. And that's how we do it, one by one, piece by piece. You can still see it's pretty steaming hot. I'm gonna try and go through this filter anyway. Hopefully it doesn't burn a hole through it. She's slowing down significantly, so we're gonna go ahead and add our gush, the gush in there, the gushy part. See, folks, looks like we got that on all through there. Fairly nice, clear solution. Not perfect, but not horrible. Good enough for our first crack. Looks like a little bit of urea there. Put me a bit in here and see what happens. Yeah, that's some active nitric. Look at that. That's what it does when you got active nature, just like that. That will uh, neutralize it pretty fast, so here. Okay, folks, I got some sodium metabisulfate here. I'm gonna add a little bit on in there. That'll be enough. I'm gonna stick this dude up on the heat here. Let that go like that for a minute. It'll uh, give it a little bit of encouragement to uh, get that material out of solution. Sure will. Well, I think we can see some gold in there, possibly. Here, let's do this. Yeah. There we, <laughs> there we go. Okay. Oh yeah, baby. You got a pile on in there a little bit now. A little bit, not much. A couple tenths. Yeah, I was hoping for about half a gram, but you know, you can't always know these things. Pouring this uh, solution off this gold carefully. We don't get too much hog pour off gold. Oh, pick you up. <laughs> screwing around talking to you. Yeah, I'm pouring gold in there. Yeah, I'm lunatic. Uh, uh, yeah, just a tiny bit. It's not much. <laughs> uh, that's my normal way. Of it. Okay. Anyway, yeah, we got a little bit of nastiness in there. I'm gonna put that dude in the crucible and melt it up. Yes, I am. Yeah, folks, I got that gold washed into that uh, crucible there. Get the rest of that moisture evapped off there. And She be folks. I hit that dude with the hammer. <laughs> yeah, folks, those are 109 grams of gold plated pins <laughs> reduced down to the gold. Let's weigh that dude in. Okay. Look at that. One tenth. It is what it is, baby. A tenth. We got a tenth, baby.